Hello everyone and welcome back to Corona's Place Persona 5 Royale. Today it looks like we can hang out with Sojuro. That's fine. Um, oh, there's a crossword puzzle. Okay, did we do that already? We might have. Cop drama is apparently interesting. Man, I don't know. I uh, I can't watch live PD. Let's, uh, I guess, play a little. But, I don't know. I've watched some of it. It just kind of gives me anxiety a little bit sometimes. My mom loves it. Like, uh, she loves it. My brother's girlfriend loves it. They, like, I don't know. Wait, what? Duck, duck, goose? Time for a trip week. So this is goose. Cross hens pro. Can I do all of these? Wait a minute. No, I can just do the blue ones. Oh, I can do all of these. So if I do... <laughs> You're not gonna let me do all of these, are you? Do I get anything... Special? For, for the... No? Um... One of 24? I don't even know what the hell that means. This is egg. Hinged barrier. No idea. Anyways, it's golden week, yeah? <laughs> is that what they're trying to go here? I need a D. And uh, N, yeah. Uh, golden week is a holiday that typically spans to the end of April to the beginning of May and includes Saturday and Sunday. Oh, that's this week then, right? Uh, the golden part of the phrase comes from the Japanese broadcasting term golden time, which refers to the most desirable time slot of the day. All right. I see. Okay, so doing the goose part didn't do anything, I think. That's kind of a shame. Okay, but now, let's go check out the, uh, the plant. We might have already done that. Nice. No, okay. Hmm, okay, so what are we doing then? We could... It's Monday. We could clean, we could study, we could read a book, we could make lockpicks. How many lockpicks do I have? Uh, what do I, where do I even find that? Essentials? Lockpick. I have four of them. That's not that bad. Gotta turn the volume a little bit. Yeah, that's not that bad. I could totally probably make it through the next area with just four? Maybe. I don't know, to be quite honest. Uh, judging by Kamashita's pals, we didn't. We only had two. So if they doubled the lock chest, then we'd be fine. But are we going anywhere else before then to Mementos? I think we do actually learn about, you know, Mementos is kind of a spoiler, but Morgana already kind of talked about Mementos. Ment. It's not Mementos, is it? It's, it's Mentos. No, that's the candy. It is Mementos. And I've been calling it Mentos, I think, maybe? I don't know. Anyways. I might need some lockpicks for that, so making more of those might be good. I should work on my intellect. Intelligence. This is the same thing. So let's... Now listen up. You won't have much time for studying when you go out into the world, so yeah. What do you want I to guess, do? yeah, let's study. Make sure you close up. Oh, absolutely not. I'm gonna leave this place open for all the thieves. Hey, hey. So is that a pencil holder thingy? I'm assuming so. Maybe it has, like, rulers and stuff in it? I never had something like that. I just put my pencils, like, in my backpack. Well, in, like, the front pouch of my backpack. So we have three days off. Woo. Okay. Come on, we're going to pawn that metal today. 
Hey, can you hear me right? Uh, you can hear me, right? You don't have plans, do you? Come help me out instead of sleeping your life away. You do owe, him, owe it to him. I do? We'll just have to wait. Hurry down and help him out. I mean... Sorry, I kind of pressured you into doing this. You did do. You did pressure us. I had plans to do nothing today. And now to our next topic. Fall from Grace. The story of a dishonored Olympic medalist. Just recently, a high school coach confessed at an assembly that he had been repeatedly abusing students. Given his prior Olympic achievements, this has caused quite a stir. What caused this habitual offender to suddenly confess these heinous crimes to his entire school? Was it before or after the original uh, Persona 5 where that freaking... Is it therapist? Like physical therapist for like the... I think it was the Olympics that kind of got into a huge scandal for similar heinous, extremely heinous crimes. The police are hoping that the upcoming interrogations will bring light to this question. Isn't this... My friends would come back from practice with bruises all the time. It was scary, but I'm relieved that the abuse is finally going to end now. He would touch me and stuff all the time. I'm glad I don't have to deal with that sexual harassment I mean, anymore. Why, why people like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't get why people would turn a blind eye to it. There were always rumors, sure. Not many people believed them, though. How could not many people believe them? Like, I'm totally shocked they were actually true. At least now I can go to school without worrying. It took Alex a day here to figure out the truth. I knew it. This is your school, isn't it? Seems like it. Uh, things might be getting turbulent at school, but you need to just keep your head down, all right? Right, stick my head into it, exactly. More importantly, keep those hands moving. I've got some more stuff I need you to do. I take check, by the way. Man. Chief really worked this hard. You didn't do anything. Did you see it? It was on the news! No way the school's gonna be able to play dumb after that. I saw it too. Shiho's name didn't come up, right? Not that I saw. I bet they wanted to keep that part quiet. I'm so glad. It's finally over. All we gotta do is, is stuff our faces and put this comma sheet of crap behind us. I'm totally looking forward to that celebration party. I'll try not to let you guys down. Yes. Alright, we need to go sell that gold medal tomorrow. Even the chief even if the chief wants help, make sure you turn him down, okay? You should have done it today. Okay. We gotta take care of business tomorrow, like we told Lady On we would do. Make sure you sell that medal. Uh plant? Nice. Ready healthy. Can I do anything? Um, I'm assuming I can study. Alright, anything on the news? Oh, it's just this crap again. Do I want to study? You know what? Let's let's make one more lockpick. Yeah. Hopefully, actually, we can make probably two, right? Hopefully, we get a bonus one as well. Okay. You can make three. Three, you say? Make it. And that should ha like that should do it for lockpicks for a little bit. Oh, we didn't get the extra one, right? Oh no, we did. So we get nine. Yes. Either I'm getting really lucky, or they increased the odds yeah. of that. Nice. Yeah. Okay. Another point. Sweet. Well then. Yeah. Let's head to bed. That should do it for lockpicks for now. Um. I'm assuming it's gonna be another Make automatic sure day. Uh, when I get back. Just do it. Don't get cocky with me. I'm not gonna get penisy with you. You're not my type. Welcome. Am I interrupting something? Yeah, I'm trying to go pawn this medal. Not at all. The cause of the runaway train incident in the subway the other day still has not been found. Police are hurrying to solve the matter as it may relate to the rise in psychotic breakdown incidents. Oh. Is that the thing everyone's been talking about? Doesn't it make you curious? 
people who were living normal lives suddenly went mad or deranged out of the blue. I mean, yeah. Not to mention that it's happening one after another. Could they really be coincidental? Hmm. Leaving that aside, what do you have? Hmm. I'll have the house blend, please. Cool. That's our specialty, I think. Are you a part-timer? I'm surprised this place can afford one. Oh, it can't. Uh, what, no. <laughs> Not exactly. Yeah, he doesn't pay me for the work I do. Can we sue him? Are you a high school student? Where do you attend? Uh, Sujin Academy. Oh, someone I know goes there as well. Someone you know, huh? I've heard that things are rough right now. As an understatement. A teacher named Kamoshida confessed his crimes like he was a completely different person, supposedly. And it happened all of a sudden one day. Can a person's mental state change so easily? I mean, yeah, I guess. Huh. <sighs> Is my drink ready yet? No, he hasn't actually moved at all. Coming right up. See ya! Alright. Today's the day we turn in that metal for cash. <laughs> sure. You know some place that'll buy it off you, right? Oh, hey, can I go to the vending machines? Actually, that's not the one I want. Can I come down here? I'm assuming you're gonna be like, no, we can't do that. Oh my god, really? Okay. <laughs> sure. Uh, you know what? Let's, uh... Maybe we could talk to people. That guy's grayed out. Just want to make sure that I'm not, like missing anyone that is hilarious you guys have faces so you're important right yeah he did do some terrible things I mean maybe I don't know I, I like I always like playing sports I was never too into sports but I just never I never really get the appeal I don't get the celebrity appeal right I don't know it could just be me I guess but I don't really, I don't care if someone's a celebrity or not. What's your, what? What are you asking me? Uh, the rumors that an informant revealed the details regarding Kamashita's criminal activity. That's correct. That's right. Spread that pop propaganda. Um, we can go down here, right? Oh, we could have gone to the underground walkway too, right? I just want to make sure that I'm not missing anything like, uh, like an NPC that maybe normally wouldn't have appeared. I don't know if they actually would or not, but they've been adding more NPCs or just characters laying about in the world in this version of the game, so I want to check that, but it doesn't look like there's anything here. All right, let's go to Central Street. I don't know why we couldn't just teleport to the... Uh, the airsoft place, but sure. Down here. Hey, guys. Oh, you guys are looking for a search warrant, huh? I'm sure this will go fine. Hey, can you uh, buy this gold medal? Uh, you again? Who do you want? I want you to buy this? Huh, gold medal? Why do you have this? We don't buy any fakes or stolen goods here, kid. Hey. Hold on a sec, let me see it. Hmm. I'm just not gonna ask where you got this. How's 30,000 yen sound for it? Uh, works for me! Huh. 30,000 it is then. Woo, we're rich! Hmm. It's almost time. Here, take this with you. It's thanks for selling me that medal. But, uh, best not to open it. Just bring it with you next time you come back. Got it. I'm glad you're so quick to understand. There. Uh, Munehisha Iwari, right? Yes? Iwari, yeah? That sounds about right. There are some matters we'd like to discuss with you today. Go, kid. You know why we're here? Huh. I don't know, looking for evidence? You tell me, Mr. Detective. Watch your attitude! Well, you guys gonna search me? Go on, do what you gotta do. 
What was that? An upstanding citizen is supposed to cooperate with the cops, right? Hey, you sure that lead was legitimate? I could have sworn it was. <laughs> Can you two hurry up? I got business to run here. You bastard. Hey, you. Why did I stand around like an idiot? What's in the bag, huh? Show me. The kid's just a regular old customer. You can check the tapes if that'll, that'll convince you. They'll show everything that's gone down here today. I don't want to be here when the detectives see the footage of me with the gold medal. I should leave. I won't let you get away that easy. Show us what's in the bag. Uh, I was actually just going. <sighs> oh, this is all starting to feel a little too fishy. Hey, you're talking to a kid, remember? Besides, he's not the one we're here to see. Uh, that's right, Mr. Detective. Maybe next time you'll try not harassing my customers and see how that goes. Grr. See ya. Safe trip, safe trip home, kid. All right. I mean, I'm sure we're not breaking the law at all. What were those detectives doing there? Uh, probably trying to find evidence. More importantly, aren't you curious about what's in the bag? Oh yeah. Maybe a little. Well. Come on, let's open it up. A real gun? Wait, I think it's just a model. Oh, really? It's incredible, though. Miles ahead of the one with Yuji had. There's something weird about that place. Really? You think? Hey, I just had a great idea. We should totally buy this gun from him later. Sure. I mean, it's perfect. Something this real looking would work wonders in the metaverse. Anyway, he told you to bring it back the next time you came, right? You should try striking a deal with him when we go to return it. Ah, paper bag. I feel like we should not carry around <laughs> this model gun that looks real. Ahn's calling me. Hi, on. I saw the news. You know, about Kamoshida. Yep. It's getting a lot of coverage. As it should. Serves him right? Yeah, serves it right. I'm still not sure about that. What do you mean? The reaction's been bigger than what I was expecting. I guess I'm just surprised. I don't think we did anything wrong, though. Oh, hell no, we didn't. I wonder if we helped those people speak up about it. Uh, it's possible. Huh? I didn't think we'd actually be able to do it. And yet, look at us now. This calls for a celebration. Let's meet in front of Shibuya Station at noon tomorrow. Don't be late. All right. Oh, and did you pawn off that medal? You didn't forget, right? Nah, I got the money. Uh, I remembered. Good to hear. I already made reservations. I mean, I'm pretty sure I could have covered it anyways. You should be really excited about the place I chose, by the way. I'm sure everyone's gonna love it. Well, see you guys tomorrow. Ah, a restaurant of Lady Anne's choosing. Finally, a decent meal. Are you gonna be allowed in? Hey, what do you think we're gonna be eating? Uh, maybe sushi. Ooh, tuna, sea urchin. Sea urchin. Salmon row. Have I ever had sea urchin? I don't think I ever had sea urchin. It doesn't sound like it would be good. In any case, I'm surely looking forward to it. <laughs> oh, do not think the Oh, maybe we do. All right, uh, plant. Nice. Uh, Okey Sure, so down here and study? Oh, check the TV first. Always check the TV. Greenery day. For real? I love that band. Yeah. Alright, I guess study. Now listen up. What do you want to do? Study, clearly. Make sure your clothes up. Ooh, is it raining out or is it just cloudy? I think it's just cloudy. Or we could be working on our kindness too, right? 
I don't know. Knowledge is so hard to increase. I remember kindness being kind of easy, though. I could just be hashtag wrong, but still. Um. Yeah. I guess we can continue with the <laughs> studying. Don't talk with your mouth open. No wonder Lady An chose this place. That's actually just a callback to me being dumb. <laughs> Earlier when I said that, it's don't don't speak while you're chewing, pretty much. Of course it's good. This is a famous hotel after all. Yeah, I would love some of that. Actually, I'm starving. Oh, yeah. I heard that the police. I probably should have ate lunch. At school. That's troublesome. Our names are gonna come up for sure. People are spreading all sorts of rumors about us and Kamoshida. Well, I mean, I was shouting in the hall to burn down the school and hit him with a metal bat. But we got him pumped up. I keep hearing stuff like the Phantom Thieves really stole his heart. I think most people don't believe it, but some of them actually seem grateful. Look at this. The Phantom Aficionado website? <laughs> Well done, Phantom Thieves. Now I can keep going too. Thank you for giving us hope. Crazy, crazy days. Pretty cool, huh? I was just desperate to deal with my own problems, but seeing people saying all this feels strange. Maybe nice? Does it feel nice? Yeah. Hey, what do we do now? Uh, we good on time? Huh? Oh crap, you're totally right! We only got an hour to eat! Just 50 minutes left! <laughs> That's it? Oh, I'm not gonna finish all the beef dishes at this pace! I need to eat my way through the entire dessert menu! Oh, that's like just asking for diabetes. Look after our stuff. We'll snag something for you guys too, don't worry. Oh man! God melts in my mouth. <laughs> Seriously? Only me? Look, there's nothing wrong with only me. Now, where should I start? It's not as healthy as it should be. It's probably a little better for you than only dessert and cake. And she's all about the cake. So happy. <laughs> hey, calories. One of these costs. I'll never get the chance to do this again. There's nothing wrong with, you know, going overboard one day. Mm -hmm. The Wilton Hotel Cake Buffet. I'd heard rumors, but I never thought it'd be so amazing. <laughs> and where's our share? I didn't really know what you'd want. Isn't that like a plate of beans? So I just grabbed you some beans. It is. What the hell? <laughs> Some pretty bizarre things there too. So we got you a variety of those. Of beans. Fried bananas, preserved eggs, and some kind of beans. That's yeah, suck. M more beans? We put so much on the plate that it got all mixed up. But it should probably still taste good. This is just plain grotesque. It looks pretty bad. Let's go. Yeah. You just don't know what fine dining means. We'll. Yeah, we'll show them. Um, leave it to me. That's reassuring. You guys watch our things while we're gone. No, bring we'll our things. I don't trust them. Mm. Oh, it's like a meaty explosion in my mouth. Kinky. Oh, this part's cream cheese. That sounds good. They're not even listening. That's why we're bringing our stuff. We can't trust them. expect from the buffet at a top class hotel yeah I guess I don't know I've it doesn't look that good <laughs> the ingredients and variety of dishes are crazy good there's a reason it costs 8,000 yen and it's 80 bucks uh, that is a lot this place does not look good here, but fish should come first I've been to a buffet I've been to a few buffets in my life Let's fill our plate with all sorts of fish. And they were Which not expensive. 
They were actually very not fancy at all. Uh, I think the most expensive one I went to was in a casino. I think it cost like 20, 25 bucks to go. That one was pretty, that one was pretty fancy. It was definitely higher quality than the other buffets that I went to that only cost like $10 to go to. But even that looked, I don't know, better than this? Like this doesn't look good. Prefer it raw, but grilled is great too. I'm sure. Have you heard, my dear? The news about that Kamashita fellow was absolutely dreadful. Oh, absolutely dreadful. Oh, right. That teacher at Shujin Academy caught doing such indecent acts. Shameful, really. Hold on a sec. And they still haven't managed to solve those horrible psychotic breakdown episodes, have they? Oh, I wish they wouldn't let themselves be distracted by such a tawdry scandal. Perhaps it's a sign of how peaceful this country is. I honestly pity those poor Shujin students. I mean, you should feel bad for them, yeah. Unless you're a piece of shit. It sounds like the Kamashita incident is the talk of the town. Hmm. Shoot, they noticed you. Just grab some food and act natural. On the plus side, we'll get to eat the food later. That's... yeah? That's why we're here! How did a child like this end up in here? I don't know, because I have a lot of money. I certainly hope you didn't bring friends. I prefer my meals to remain hooligan Oh, hooligan. just dump the Thank food on our head. Come, let us go. Come now, let us go! What's so bad about kids coming to enjoy a buffet? Hmm. I wonder how the other people here are reacting to the news. I mean, honestly, who cares? Maybe there are more people we can eavesdrop on at other tables. Sure. Um, well, that's kind of desserty. What's over here? I mean, it's dessert too. Is this all freaking dessert? I kind of just want to get like food. Yeah, rice dishes. Rice is incredible. Can you eat rice? Of every great meal. Not every great meal. Sorry. I got a bit carried away there. Cats don't usually eat rice, though, right? So, the ratings for the news were really that good? It was because it was about that teacher who sexually harassed his student, huh? Was it Kamoshida? It's all about how you frame it. You've got to cater to the idiotic public. I mean, you're not wrong. Ratings go up when you show them crude, sensational news and make it easy for them to understand. <sighs> Sadly! How can he be so insensitive? A student almost killed herself because of that Kamoshida. Yeah, they're kind of scumbags. By the way, do you think these sudden changes of heart might be real? Well, that's... Hmm? Quick, grab some food! Yeah, we gotta learn how to not listen oh, on people. Crispy bits. So obviously. Crispy bits? Crispy bits? So In rice? he had a sudden change of heart, he just confessed to all his crimes? Isn't that just burnt rice? <laughs> Who knows? Sorry, but it's time. I have to go. I'll call you again after the meeting. A sudden change of heart, huh? I suppose I can't blame him for seeing it that way. I mean, how else are they supposed to see it? Hmm. I wonder how the other people here are reacting to the news. Probably the same way. Let's get some more food and listen in. Uh, meat dishes! <gasps> Ryuji, but a meal is just not the same if you don't have any. I got distracted. We're here to eat, dog. When you really look at it, he's just an ex athlete who overestimated himself. He should have just accepted his lot in life and quietly done his job as a teacher. Oh, he would have spent less time in jail, yeah. It's not even an incident we can take seriously. The whole story is pretty ridiculous. We should probably look into it. But we can also just let the low-ranking scrubs handle it. Look into? I guess they're investigating Kamoshida? They don't sound very enthusiastic about it, though. Hmm? Yeah, grab some food! Ah, get the part that's not too fatty. Well, there's nothing wrong with fatty meat. It's kind of delicious sometimes. I mean, you don't want too much fat, sure. Also, how'd you... Are you allowed in here, Morgana? 
I feel like this gonna be arriving soon. kind of place would not allow we cats. Don't keep them waiting, so we better get going too. Or any animal besides the ones we're eating. What is he going to discuss with the higher ups? Well, I'm sure it's more important than lunch. Nothing's more important than lunch. We were dressed quite well, but they still looked pretty shady to me. Hmm. I wonder how. Okay, that's the same thing as before. So dessert. Uh, hey Ryuji, what's up? Oh, okay. On. How's your cake? <laughs> Everything's so good. Talking like Adam Sandler. Oh, up close, it looks even bigger and more delicious. This giant sweet. What is that like? A chocolate fountain? I got distracted. News travels quick. It's already all over the internet. You know, the story about how Kamashita got his ass kicked by some world reforming heroes. Woo! It doesn't sound like a serious story to me. Some of the details are pretty far-fetched. I mean, that's true. Don't worry about it. We just have to do what they tell us to do. It's all rumors made up by school kids anyway. If it's gripping news, who cares if it's not true? I mean, I do? <laughs> so they don't believe themselves. But they're making up stories to make the Phantom Thieves seem real. There's nothing more frustrating and annoying seeing people share, like, just misinformation and completely untrue news. Like, just from freaking idiots on the internet. It's so annoying. And they're doing this in front of the actual Phantom Thieves. Hmm? Whoa, act fast and get some food! And make sure it's got a lot of whipped cream! What's wrong? Ah, uh, nothing. I thought some weird kid was looking at us, that's all. Oh, I am. Why don't we go? It's almost time for the meeting. I like your glasses. Well, that was rude. Did you hear him? He said you were weird. I mean, to be fair, I am. Don't think there's anyone else we can listen in on. Oh, thank God, because this wasn't awkward at all. But it's shocking. So many of the adults here don't seem like nice people. Yeah, they kind of seem like assholes, you're right. Now, according to what we heard, it seems most adults aren't very interested in the news about Kamoshida. Well, now that we've got a nice variety of food on our plates, let's head back to the others. <laughs> you brought a ton back! What do you think about coming up against such ritzy food? I mean, sure. I just want to eat. I was thinking that too, but take a bite. Using better ingredients makes stuff taste way different. I mean, yeah, the fresher the ingredients, the better, which usually costs more, sure. Look at you, acting like you have a refined palate all of a sudden. Don't you think you're eating too much, Mona? Mm, there's no... Knowing when we'll get to come here again. Sure, but you guys brought back loads of food. It'd be a shame to let it all go to waste. I haven't even eaten anything yet. Why don't you help them out, Ryuji? Oh, we should both help. Oh, me? I'm way too stuffed. I couldn't possibly help. She says as she shovels another piece of cake into her mouth. Yeah, stuffing your face with cake. <laughs> Whatever. Let's deal with this ourselves. I mean, the cake does look pretty good. I'm more of a cheesecake guy. It feels like no matter how much we eat, the amount of food we have stays the same. There's still more? Don't give up. Let's keep at it. We... we did it. No, no, there's still rolls over there. My belt feels multiple sizes too small. <laughs> Oh yeah. This is a victory for all of us. That was a breeze. Oh, is your stomach the size of a freaking palace? Maybe. Good job, you guys. How about one last dish to cleanse your palates? I don't know what that means, but sure. I recommend the seasonal tart. The grapefruit has both alluring sweetness and a tangy sourness. Uh, stop. I don't want to hear about sour stuff. <laughs> uh, this isn't good. I gotta go to the bathroom. 
me to. Please carry me gently. I mean, you're in my bag, so no. My, look at that table. Come now, pay them no attention. I'm sure they must not normally have the chance to eat such exquisite food. I mean, you're right. I can only imagine what their parents must be like. What was that? We don't got time for that. Come on, let's go. I mean, why do I have to go? You bring Mona with you. Ugh, I'm stuffed. I totally panicked when I saw the closed for cleaning sign at the bathrooms. You were talking big about eating until you puke. Ugh. You really did puke. Are you some kind of moron? That's not healthy. Hey, same goes for you. What floor was that restaurant on? We came up to get here, so it has to be on a lower floor, right? You just really should have paid attention to that. What the? There's still no update on the case. Not yet. Excuse me, but why are you so involved? It's not something you should be concerned with. I don't care about your opinion, you incompetent buffoon. When I say pick up the pace, you do it. Hmm, sounds like you need to find a new boss. Hey, you're cutting in line. What do you want? Uh, apologize to Ryuji for bumping into him, you little bitch. We're in a hurry. I don't give a shit. Oh, I'm sorry. So you can butt in front of other people if you're in a hurry? It seems the customer base has changed since I was here last. Have they started a daycare? What kind of daycare do you go to that has this old of children there? What? Sir, we don't have time for this. I know. Push him back! Don't bother with him. To give him deja vu. What the hell was with that bossy guy? Shouldn't we head back down? Yeah, but that dick really pissed me off. He wasn't even hiding the fact that he looks down on everyone. Don't lose your temper over this. I just can't forgive shitty adults like that. Yeah. It's not even just adults, shitty people in general. Almost sounds like the one from back then. I wonder why. What's wrong? Uh I'm okay, probably. You sure? No. You're not looking so hot. I always look hot. It's probably because he never eats well. I'm always stuck with canned cat food. Dude, what are you talking about? My cats love canned cat food. Like seriously. They, they hate the hard stuff. Yeah, that sir bullshit makes me sick. Damn it. What took you so long? Sorry, I had a poop. Why are you all pissy? Sorry. I had a run in with some woman a second ago. She bumped into me, but then said it was all my fault when she dropped her plate. Sounds like a real bitch. Yeah? Yeah. Thanks, though. But the restaurant workers all looked at me with this disapproving expression. We should have knocked more plates down. I wonder if we're out of place here. I mean, yeah, probably. Uh, do, 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 do. I guess it always feels like this. It seems, yeah, I guess it always seems like it. <clears throat> hey, Morgana. What is it? Anyone could have a palace, yeah? Anyone with a strong, distorted desire. Same for them having a change of heart if their treasure gets stolen? That would be the case. Why are you bringing this up all of a sudden? We had trouble earlier, too. These selfish shitheads who just look down on everyone else. I was just wondering if we'd be able to change those kinds of people, too. You mean, you want to continue as the Phantom Thieves? I mean, it is good money. I've been thinking. 
We put a lot of work into changing Kamoshida's heart, but nobody believes in the Phantom Thieves. Plus, those guys who had no other choice but to just deal with it are thanking us. Us, of all people. Uh, do 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 do. There are a lot of victims. I. I agree. If we ignore people who are in trouble, I'd go back to being the same as I was before. Well, that's true. You're under my tutelage. There's nothing we can't accomplish as phantom thieves. Didn't you stop teaching us halfway through the other palace? Wait a minute. I didn't think it... I didn't, I didn't even think of such a possibility. But it's true that with this power comes great responsibility. We also may be able to help people. But that means we'll have to fight shadows again, doesn't it? Indeed, that can't be avoided. Eh, I'm sure we'll manage. Yeah, probably. <laughs> right. Uh, shh, fine by me. Even if you guys are still just fledglings, this means we're an actual organization now. Fledglings? <laughs> That's actually pretty fitting for us. All right, it's settled. We're gonna catch all these shitty adults by surprise and make ourselves known to the world. Are you okay being our leader? Uh, of course. No objections here? I can't handle all that responsibility stuff. Yeah, I know. <laughs> That's Where's pretty obvious. But Lady Ann made the recommendation, so I'll allow it. Well, should we decide on a name for our group? How about the Phantom Thieves? Yeah, I just went with Phantom Thieves of Hearts last time, but don't you think a real name would be cooler? No. Ooh, I got it. I want it to be something both cute and luxurious sounding. Let so, Kronos? How about the diamonds? <laughs> the diamonds. <laughs> I'm getting the real Little League baseball feel from it. <laughs> the diamonds. Well then, here's my suggestion. How about Tilefish Poilet? Huh. Tile, uh, what? I know you know what that means. That's what I ate earlier. It's commemorative, no? No, it's dumb. No, you idiot. Uh, you decide. For okay, us. how about the Phantom Thieves? Uh, your na teammate may be seen by others when when using the network service. Please be cautious not to enter any personal information. <laughs> oh, I know, I know the perfect name for the Phantom Thieves. What's my social security number? Uh, furthermore, please do not enter a name that could be considered offensive. I guess the phantoms? Oh, the phantom menaces. No, the phantoms are fine. Yeah, let's go with that one, sure. Huh, that's not bad at all. I guess. A good name for a rookie. Coming from someone who just wanted to name it after the fish in the interstate? Eh. We going with that? Sure. Well, now that the name's set, Phantom Thieves Assemble! Our next target. There are tons of rotten adults and all. Why not just stick to targeting big names? Uh, like a celebrity, like a CEO. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, something along those lines. If we go after some bigwig, it's gotta get on the news, right? Don't you think more people would believe in us if we did that? That's not a bad idea. For you, Ryuji. I mean, it was a pretty good idea in general. True. If we become better known, we might be able to give courage to a lot more people. I don't really like the idea of just picking someone out of the blue, though. Could do is, like, pull a name from a hat. Let's narrow it down to someone we can all agree on, then. Hmm. So we need a big wig we decide on unanimously. I mean, that shouldn't be that hard. I like that unanimous decision part. It's like we're making some kind of pact. Now then, this is the official formation of the Phantom Thieves organization. Oh no! 
our time for the buffet ran out. You know, I'm pretty sure Ryuji just puked, so that's fine. I guess we'll just have to talk more tomorrow. Oh, that's weird looking. <laughs> Another world in which people's distorted cognitions take shape? Stealing treasure to change hearts? And on top of that, a talking cat told you all this. I'm not insane, I swear. Uh, it's all true. Honestly speaking, that all sounds absurd. You don't say. It's hard to believe that this is even worth listening to. Still, it can't be considered nonsense when parts of it align with Kamoshida's confession. The same goes for the testimonies of the officers who arrested you. But so be it. At any rate, you mentioned something more important. These two other accomplices, besides this talking cat thing that appeared in your story. From what you've been telling me, they're students at the same school, aren't they? Uh, perhaps? Perhaps? Don't take me for a fool. Very well, I'll leave it at that. Let's continue on. I feel like we shouldn't be naming Ryuji and An here. The questioning's not over anyway. If you are making this up, the cracks in your story will prove it. The next to receive a calling card was this individual. Oh, okay. The master of Japanese arts, Ichiryusai Matarame. Took me a second there to actually remember what the dude looked like. For a like, I didn't recognize him. It's even more incomprehensible than Kamoshida as to why this man was targeted. Where did you come to know him? And how did you learn of his crimes when you weren't a victim of them? Start by telling me what you all schemed. I guess first I went back home, and then I went to see if my plant needed to be fed. And then I probably studied or did a crossword puzzle, maybe? Ah, well, we spent all our money on the buffet. We better not have spent all our money on the buffet. We officially established the fame with you, so it's totally worth it. Okay, I'm a little mad by that, but sure, that's fine. The fan of these, huh? I'm liking the sound of that. Hope we can really help people. I'm curious about that fan of aficionado website, too. I wonder who made it. No clue. More importantly, you see the survey on there? I don't know how I feel about it. Yeah, there was this approval rating thing, but it was only like 6%. Ah, that's low. That's better than I expected. I guess it's not so bad if you put it that way. But don't you just want to get it higher than that? I bet it'd go up tons if we keep taking down big targets. It's pretty damn exciting if you try and think about it like that. You know, you're actually right. Well then, let's keep working hard from this point on. Uh, Thieves' Den. The Thieves' Den has been unlocked. You can access the Thieves' Den from the menu or the title screen. At the Thieves' Den, you'll be able to do various activities such as view arts, listen to music, or play card games. You unlock more with the story with story progression, so stop by now and then. What? Oh yeah, let me send this. Yeah, let me send the, the celebrity ticket. Uh, Pick, yeah, pick I took today. Celebrating the founding of the Phantom Thieves and celebrating us crashing the cl that classy buffet. Huh, that's a good picture. Uh, you can cool it with all the celebrating any time now. Wait, you took that while I was eating? Why didn't you tell me? <laughs> I did, you just never stopped eating. Anyways, this is our start as the Phantom Thieves. We're gonna take the world by storm. All the shitty adults in the world better watch, us, uh, watch out for us. Um, okay. So that's just completely new, but we'll check it out next time. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, press the like below. If you're not subscribed yet, one of my videos, I can check out some of the content, see if it's to your liking. Once again, thank you for watching. Hope you all have a great day.